Good morning everyone. So today, it's currently 7.20, so very early in the morning, if you can't tell. I'm so tired. But today I'm vlogging a trip to Brighton with my college. I go to fashion college. It's called the Fashion Retail Academy and it's in central London. And usually, it's two days a week, so usually my days are Monday and Thursday, but it's currently Tuesday. And we're going, uh, we're going, oh, sorry, it's so early, I can't even process my words. Going on a trip to Brighton for research. So I have to be at college at 8.30 and then I think I'll coach the parts at nine. I actually could get my own train to Brighton, but it costs like 25 pounds and I might as well just spend like four pounds to get up to London and get the coach for free. And also I'll be with all my friends, it'll be really fun. But um, yeah, so I go to fashion college and we're currently on our second project, which is about visual merchandising. We're working with a charity shop called Trade. Um, but we're just basically going to Brighton to get like research about other charity shops because obviously Brighton has a lot of like vintage shops, stuff like that really. So I'm sorting up my hair because I literally need to leave in like five minutes. So I need to make sure my hair's all done. But yeah, I set my hair in a bun last night so it's went all curly. And this is the outfit. I'll give a little outfit check. I actually need to get my bag ready as well because I don't know what bag I'm bringing yet. So need to sort that out highlighter in my inner corners and i don't know if i like it or not because i never really do that usually but i'll show you my outfit my room is a tip so in the back of it looks gross but sorry um my jacket is from urban outfitters i got it the other day bdg jeans i've never heard of i don't really ship in urban outfitters that much because it's expensive but i treat myself to this jacket and i think it's really nice fits so nicely as well and then this jacket jumper is my sister's i don't know where it's from i think she got it from asos top is super dry can't even see my jeans because of the camera but my jeans are literally just like low-waisted like, like mid-rise low-waisted jeans from zara because zara are the only pair of jeans that i can find that fit and then my shoes are new balance but you can't even see them my hair is literally atrocious I don't know how to sort this out. Put my phone back in charge as well because I need full charge for Brighton. Like, how do I sort this out? I might just put it in a bun because it's not going to look good for the whole day. Today, I put some mascara on because I never usually wear mascara, but because I've done like a bit of bronzer on my inner corners and stuff, um, not inner corners, on my eye, I feel like I need a mascara. So I literally put the thinnest layer on and I think it actually looks really good for once. Usually I hate mascara, but I put my hair in a ponytail. It doesn't look very good, but... I'm just gonna bring a hairbrush with me and sort it out when I'm there because I don't know how I want my hair yet. But yeah. Also, my mum's giving me a lift to the station because she's going to work today, which is really good because otherwise I'd have to leave right now to walk to the station. But I'm getting a lift, so don't need to leave, which is really nice. Hi guys, Ruby's takeovers. Birthday queen tomorrow. What the hell? Hi guys, Ruby's takeovers. On the train. No, it's not the train, is it? The coach. I'm going to Brighton. We're getting posted. Yes, it is. Don't be so weird. Anyways, I'm really scared. I'm watching um, EastEnders. Ellie, do you want to be in it? Yay. This is basically my vlog now. We'll be take over. Well, guys, we met Rosie. We got the train. We got the train here. Um, we're <laughs> I can't find. We're now in Brighton, and my hair is awful. And we're in the arcade. Yeah. And we're supposed to be doing the end, but I don't know how this is helping. So we're just going to use that as fun. But yeah. It's called Crazy Mouth. Yeah. There's Gracie. Gracie. Oh. Gracie, say hi. Hello. <laughs> We've got cards, we've got cute cards, say with a fiver on, so we've got on the boxes. And we're scared, and it's gonna go, three of us are gonna go on together, and then I think me and Ruby are gonna go as the two because we're the tallest. Well, and apparently, we can go five. I don't, maybe because we're small. We're, we're, small, small, we're, we're small and petite, so I might be able to. Instead, 
Mine doesn't work. Is it not? Do you want to use it? Because you pay. Right. You start. <laughs> I'm just going to copy you. This is so easy. Why did you pick the easy one? Why did you pick the easy one? I can't do it. guys i'm now home <laughs> i literally forgot to film just because i'm not used to obviously like taking videos because that's my first like youtube video so yeah it's like seven no it's not seven o'clock it's like 6 30 i'll tell you everything about the trip basically i had no idea what we were doing because i literally had not read the email or anything i just showed up um but we basically so we got there around 11 and on the pier um we went on the walters which was like a fiver so it was very expensive but it was really fun, obviously. I'm like midway picking on my pajamas, by the way. So I just ignore that. I'm gonna shower in the morning because honestly, I'm so tired. I can't. <laughs> I can't shower right now. I can't do that. Um, but I'm going out tomorrow, so I need to like wash my hair and stuff. But yeah. So ow. So <laughs> we went like on the waltzes. Me and Ruby also did some weird dance thing, which I actually think I took a video of. So that will probably be before. Um. But yeah, it was actually really fun. Like. The, it, the coach journey was long like when i tell you long it was so long it was like two hours there and then like two and a half hours on the way back mm, like two hours 15 on the way back so it was long but it was really fun and also like literally half of our class didn't come so we literally had coach like half the coach pool which meant we can all like spread out which was nice um and then yeah after the sorry i'm kind of like jumping ahead after the here we had like a little lunch break so we went to this little cafe it's really nice we got burgers and stuff i mean it was a bit overpriced for what it was because the burgers were literally like 12 pounds they weren't even that big and i was still hungry after it but it was still cute and then we looked around the vintage shops and like the high street like the old high street where like yeah the vintage shops charity shops are which again was cute i mean i don't go to brighton that often because it's just kind of effort to get there well it's not it takes me like an hour to get there but i just rather go to london and be not i mean to like go shopping and stuff but it was really it was really fun um i got five guys milkshake on the way back because i literally just needed some sort of sugar like after that burger i needed like something sugary and i tried to get a crepe but i couldn't find one anywhere which is a bit weird because like obviously brighton by the pier you think there's gonna be like crepes donuts stuff like that but yeah my makeup is literally disgusting now so i need to take it off finished putting on my pajamas and i'm literally my room is a tip but i'm just gonna clean it in the morning i was just gonna do like a brighton trip but i think i'm gonna carry it on on thursday because i'm going to college on thursday going to college on thursday obviously so i think i'm gonna film a bit of college as well because when i was like thinking of going to fashion college i was literally watching everyone's youtube videos who post youtube videos about college so i feel like i should do a bit of college videos so yeah you'll see that hopefully after this i think i'm also going to show you a bit of my college work because again if you're interested in like fashion college you might want to see a bit of the work which if so i'll show you that okay so i'm back again sitting on my bed um i'm going to show you some of the work that we're doing at the moment because obviously i don't really film a lot today so i don't know maybe you might want to see what we're getting up to 
the project that we just started on it's called fast fashion slows down we started it i think this is our second week of doing it third week second week i think second week i can't i literally can't remember so we've got seven deliverables and if you don't really understand what a deliverable is it's basically like a final outcome so like a deliver a little del deliverable could be like create a five minute video about a brand of your choice for their instagram or whatever so yeah we've got seven this time whereas last project our first project we only had three so it's like getting up a bit more um and we're working with a charity shop called trade which is like basically just a charity shop um that sells like clothes books basically everything they sell everything so these are our deliverables this time and so far we we've just started deliverable four and i just need to finish it which i'll probably do tonight or like tomorrow night um but like for example deliverable one was just an infographic of the retail team slash roles like to do visual merchandising um so we have to like show all the stuff before we actually you know show the infographic that's the infographic and like then deliverable two was customer profile board so we had to choose a customer who might shop at trade so like obviously we had to do all the research kind of before it and then this was my final one it's basically very like loosely linked to me like girly you know like fashion stuff like that and then like deliverable and then you obviously have to talk about it again deliverable three visual merchandising guidelines which you had to do uh two four oh, i did four i should to add the photo there install tech signage yeah that's not a very good deliverable this is the deliverable we're doing right now deliverable four e-commerce mock-up so we had to basically reinvent trades website so well like we had to make them like a shopping web website basically because they don't have one um so i looked at like other websites that my target audience person might want to shop at right so yeah that's like my little home page <laughs> that's me um i don't know why that's so blurry as well it shouldn't be that blurry um and then i just started like what you know something could look like like for a piece or like an item so yeah, I need to finish that. And then, yeah, so then we have to do... I'm actually talking so much. But then we also need to do, like, research. So research is basically just, like, how... Oh, my God, I'm so red there because I've just itched myself. Um, research is basically just, like, how research towards our work. It doesn't actually need to be about our work. It literally could just be, like, let's say I went to, like, a museum. I could add that to my research folder. So we have primary research and secondary research. I'm not going to get too much into it because if you want to know more, I can make, like, a separate video on this because I'm now a YouTuber. Um but yeah so like research i've done like instagram poll research where like i ask questions on my instagram i listened to like a podcast went to charity shops to look at their vm um we looked at like different brands like we do case studies for that so that's kind of the research side of it then we have to do a bibliography which is basically just like referencing the stuff that we use uh which is really boring so i'm not gonna show that um i'll show you some of my research so these are like some of my research slides um why like we read reports we had to just make notes on them uh role of the vision merchandiser history of trade so we just had to look at their history like what they've done already look at their social medias this is all research um difference between merchandising and visual vis uh, window displays because i don't really know the difference h and m products and limitation basically we got loads i've got so much so i'm not going to show all of that but then we've got glossary, which I fucking hate. I don't see the point in it. Honestly, I literally have not done that. And then bibliography, I haven't added yet because I'm doing it on my big. And then weekly journals. So this is like an example of a weekly journal. I haven't done week three yet because we're on week three. Oh, there you go. We're on week three. I was confused whether we're on week two or week three, but we're on week three. So yeah. Weekly journals, if you can't really tell by the name, is basically just summing up what you did in that week. So what went good, bad, things you need to improve on, like how you felt during the week, like what you need to do for next week. Have I already said that? I can't remember. So it's basically that, if that makes sense. You just have to sum up like what, how your weeks went. And then you can like add pictures, make it look all pretty. Like some people do those on like Instagram, which I do mine on Instagram, but I also do it on the PowerPoint because I like making it look pretty, but I do put it on Instagram just in case like, people want to see it. Sorry, it's Halloween, so all the trick or treaters are out. But yeah, that's basically my work at the moment. I'm on, I've got 74 slides so far, which is fucking mad because I'm literally only like halfway through the project. So I'll probably end up with like 100 slides, which is a lot. But yeah, 
I'm really enjoying it, if you can't tell, I really like Fashion College, so this is your sign to go. But yeah, I'm gonna um get ready for bed now, because my makeup, actually it looks kind of good, but I look really oily, so I need to go take it off with my hair. Um, So yeah, I will see you guys probably on Thursday, because I'm probably not going to vlog tomorrow, because it's just boring. It's the next day. It's currently Wednesday. I've got college tomorrow. Tomorrow's Thursday. Um, and I just thought I'd vlog before because a lot of the time in the morning, I never have enough time to vlog because I literally have to leave at 7.30 and I usually like start my makeup at like 7 because I like it being nice and fresh. Like I feel like if I did my makeup at like 6.30 by the time I get to college, it's probably just going to look disgusting. So I always try to literally leave it to like the very last minute. Um, so yeah, I probably won't have enough time to like vlog tomorrow, like morning before I get into college. So yeah, it's like... 6 30 at the moment i think and i'm just gonna i'm already in my pajamas and i've had a shower i'm just literally just gonna swallow my room it's an absolute mess uh pack my bag for college tomorrow i need to have dinner do my skincare stuff like that i'm gonna do that all and then i'm gonna try to go to bed quite early tonight because i just feel like i went to bed at like 8 45 last night which is honestly so early for me like you don't i've never went to bed that early honestly so I'm going to try to do the same kind of thing tonight, like go to bed by like 9.30 because I feel like I just need good night's sleeps, like especially for college. You're literally up in London all day and I just feel so tired by the end of it. So I feel like it'll be good if I get a good sleep. But yeah, I'll probably see you tomorrow morning. Mm, no, tomorrow once I'm in London, Um, maybe in prep because I always get a prep before college. So yeah, you'll probably see me in prep in the next clip. Or maybe just already in college. I'm not sure yet. So you have to wait and see. Good morning, guys. Actually, I'm ready. My mum is on the phone. But I'm ready to leave for the station. I'm actually ready in time. Once in my life. And we also did Guess Who, we put post-it notes. We played that for about five minutes. Yeah, but it was still fun. Um, it's gonna be in it later on. Yeah, come on, share the love. I'm Rosie. Thing. Say what we're well, doing. Well, she's 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 gone ready. She's Guys, because of the weather warnings, we're getting sent home early. I'm slacking in the office saying I live in Hackney. Because of the weather warnings, we're getting sent home early, so we're gonna go watch the Christmas lights. <laughs> Oh my god, we're going home. We're going home. Ow! Oh, so, hi. what we got? my jacket. We'll be sitting in this jacket. We're now in Zara. Guys, it's now like 3 o'clock, I think. The Christmas lights did not turn on. It was a lie. They weren't on. So, I'm now walking home to the station and I had to go pick up. It's our parcel for my mum. So I did that. But yeah, it was all a lie. Did not turn on. Waste of time. But I had to, yeah, I had to go pick up the our parcel. Now I'm walking back to the station. We get on the train and go to my dad's house for dinner. And then back to my mum's house. Honestly though, today, like this morning, I didn't really film anything, I can't lie. 
which I do kind of regret. But um, I did quite a bit of work. Maybe I'll show it when I get home. Um, and then yeah, I was actually gonna, I was gonna film a lot this afternoon. And then obviously because we got sent home early, I didn't, which really pissed me off because I wanted to film a couple of clips of what we were doing, but never mind. And to make things even worse, I forgot my Zara return, so I'm gonna have to go do it this weekend or on Monday when we go to college. <laughs> it's really annoying. Oh my god. 